This method uses the principle of the yeast-2 hybrid system in bulk populations to identify protein-protein interactions that answer key questions about a variety of molecular and cellular processes. This technique leverages deep sequencing to see the interactions of one protein versus another. Since this approach is geared to make parallel comparisons, it can identify sets of proteins that interact with one protein versus another, or different conformations of the same protein, or wild type in a disease-causing mutant version to reveal differential interactomes. A new yeast-2 hybrid bait plasmid, PTEF-GBD, was constructed for this procedure as described in the text protocol. This plasmid produces GAL4 DNA binding domain fusion proteins within a TRIP1 centromere-based low-copy plasmid carrying the canamycin resistance gene that also allows cloning of bait fragments both upstream and downstream of the GAL4 DNA binding domain. This bait plasmid was used to transform MAT-A yeast, and expression of the GAL4 bait fusion proteins was verified by immunoblotting with anti-MYC antibodies. In addition, a new yeast-2 hybrid library in the streamlined prey plasmid vector PGAL4AD was created. Genomic DNA was fragmented by shearing, psi selected, modified with adapters, and inserted into PGAL4AD to create the Saxair tab yeast-2 hybrid library. To begin the procedure for creating yeast populations with bait and prey libraries, inoculate 3 milliliter cultures of each of the MAT-A yeast transformants carrying the various TRIP1-containing bait plasmids in CSM-TRIP medium. Include two separate cultures containing the...